chilling there. Good morning, it's day 15 of Redditch and I've been up for a couple of hours. Um, the shot of the female peacock was at about 6 o'clock and it's, oh actually been up for longer than that now because it's 20 to 9 and spent a bit of time just uh, focusing my thoughts. I watched a really good video by um, somebody that had done an intro for Louie. I uh, looked at her videos when she did the intro quite a few months ago and uh, she's got some nice little videos so I'll link that below and this was, I think she might be studying English literature or something. She's an Arab girl that lives in Sweden I think and she did a really interesting video about James Allen, about a James Allen book or a chapter of a James Allen book about thoughts and purpose. It was just really helpful for this moment. So today's Father's Day. Uh, we are going to go to church again, to our little community church. I'm leading the music through and then we're going to have a Father's Day lunch. My mum and dad are coming around and Louie's going to be here as well to spend other days with his father, or at least lunch. <laughs> lunch with my dad. I didn't get a chance to vlog anything because I was too busy kind of serving up and everything but uh, you'll be able to see a little bit of that on Lily's vlog. And then this evening we went out uh, with Louis and Hilary and our old neighbour Mimi uh, to just have a little time out to celebrate with Ben being father. And I have had such a hectic week unsurprisingly I know I feel so tired <laughs> that you know when you're so tired your stomach hurts it's a bit like that so it's only like half past seven in the evening but I feel like I need to turn in for the night and I feel kind of guilty because I feel like I need to be helping Darcy kind of straighten out her room and get her stuff ready for school and she's got her first mock exam tomorrow um, so I will either have a uh, cat nap, a power nap, and then get up and <laughs> help a bit more, or oh, that's it for the night. So I'll sign off for the moment just in case that's it for the night, <laughs> and I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, it's day 16. It's not a good sign really when you wake up tired, is it? <laughs> I must have got to sleep about 8 o'clock, and it is now... Uh, 20 to 6. Hi guys, here I am at Surbiton. I am really not feeling too good, which is not surprising considering how much I've been pushing myself and I'm not really <laughs> paying attention to um, all the things that made me feel ill before, so I just need to really be more careful. <laughs> Well, apart from the fact that my makeup's worn off, uh, there aren't any other bits of vlog to evidence the fact that I actually have been up to London on the train, on the underground, been into the office, popped out for lunch, popped back into the office, gone to Boots, oh here's a bit of evidence, to get some conditioner and a toothbrush for Darcy. And now I'm back. <laughs> but you could see any of the other vlogs that show my journey to know what that was like. It gets a bit repetitive. I feel like a big weight has been lifted off because I'm now going to bill for that work and I'm not going back in until he asks me to go back in and he probably won't be desperate for any more updates although it's not perfect for a little while. 
<sighs> so I can breathe the sigh of relief. And um, just got to go home and face the tension at home to do with exams and that kind of thing. Um, and the other stresses are um, just my mum's health and then making plans for the summer because we haven't nailed those yet and that's kind of always that's another source of stress I don't know what you guys find but like when things haven't been decided it's sort of like you, your brain doesn't know where to go I wonder what this evening will bring I do normally once a month have a nice jazz thing in Kingston to go to but I can't see myself getting a chance to go to that because Darcy's a little bit unhappy about her exams and stuff so have to do something fun at home instead of going out. <laughs> so we've got pizza tonight for tea. There's a sloppy Giuseppe in the oven and I am going to do half of this margarita as a Veneziana and add the usual ingredients of capers, red onion and pine kernels based on Pizza Express pizzas. Well, today hasn't been a very vlog worthy day um, so I'll probably edit this in with maybe tomorrow's vlog which I think will be a bit more eventful and 